How to Withdraw Money from Coinbase Wallet to Bank Account 2023 Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and incredible day. I bring you back with yet another fun and informative video and in this video we're going to be discussing about Coinbase Wallet and how you can withdraw your money from Coinbase to your proper fully verified and digitized bank account, okay? And uh, we're going to be talking about it all in great depth. And it's going to be a really fun topic to discuss. It's going to be a really fun thing to have. So please do make sure to watch this video till the end and listen to all the information that I have to provide you with. Because if you do that properly, then I guarantee you that fully by the end of this video, you are going to know how to put money into your Coinbase, how to use Coinbase, how to install Coinbase Wallet, and how you can withdraw money from your Coinbase Wallet to your bank account. So without further ado, let's just get straight into it. So what you're going to do is you're going to come here on Google and write Coinbase Wallet. Okay. Once you write Coinbase Wallet, you're going to come to this website where they're going to, it's going to be coinbase.com slash wallet. Now over here, you can see tons and tons of things. Okay. Coinbase wallet, your key to the world of crypto store and manage all of your crypto NFTs and multiple wallets in one place support for hundreds of thousands of tokens and dApps. Explore the decentralized web on your phone if you want to. Okay. And you know, a whole lot more, you know, you can protect your digital assets with industry leading security and much, much more. It's really amazing, really great stuff. And uh, you can also learn like the Web3, which is being used in the wallet, you know, navigate Web3 confidently with helpful resources and guides. Coinbase wallet is your key to Web3, you know, learn how to use your wallet and start collecting NFTs, etc. So and it's a really fun thing to have. You can also, as you can see, unlock the world of crypto life on the blockchain made simple and secure. Control your crypto with, you know, Coinbase wallet, which is a self custody wallet, giving you complete control of your crypto. Store all of your NFTs, you know, safely store them and easily view all of your Ethereum and Polygon NFTs right in your wallet. Industry leading security, additional security options on all of your devices provide more ways to keep your crypto safe and secure. And it also works with your proper Coinbase. So in case you're a Coinbase customer, it's great for you. You can also get every ERC20 from Aave to ZRX, you know, decentralized uh, currencies and apps, which is also pretty good. Your wallets, keys, and crypto. You know, Coinbase Wallet is a self custody crypto wallet, putting you in a control of your crypto keys and data. Now you can safely store your crypto and rare NFTs in one place. You can also explore the decentralized web with confidence. You know, Coinbase Wallet is your password to the decentralized web where you can harness the power of decentralized finance to earn yield, grow your NFT collection, and much, much more. So, you know, Use DeFi liquidity pools to support or borrow crypto, you know, swap assets on decentralized exchanges, join a DAO and help shape a major Web3 project. So, you know, pretty great stuff. Then obviously easiest way to get cash to get from cash to NFT, you know, really simple stuff. So let's go ahead and actually download the wallet. So you're going to go ahead and click on download Coinbase wallet. So you have three options. You know, you can either download for iOS, download it for Android or download it to your Chrome. Now, download for Chrome is basically your extension option. OK, you can get a proper extension, which is uh, also I'd say I would recommend that personally. So Coinbase wallet extension here, you have it. You're going to click on add to, you know, I'm using Opera, but you could obviously be using Google or anything like that. But do make sure that extensions are supported on your browser or else, you know, it could have issues. So we're just going to pin it up here. And as you can see, now I have successfully downloaded my Coinbase wallet extension. Now, once we click on it, look what it gives us. Uh, it's going to ask us to basically, you know, uh, you could either already have a wallet or you could create a new wallet. Now, I don't have a wallet, so let's go ahead and create a new wallet. So back up your wallet. Save these 12 passwords in your manager. Okay, so you could obviously copy them to your clipboard. You saved it, right? Verify that you saved your secret recovery phase by clicking on the first and then the last word. Okay, so, you know, let's see what are the words that it gave us. So search and luggage. Okay, now obviously... I'm doing this on the video because uh, obviously I'm just making this wallet to, you know, give you guys a, um, you know, general outlook on how things will actually work once you're doing this. I'm not actually going to be using this wallet for myself. 
So then you're going to make a password. Make sure it's a strong, well-developed password. There we go. And once you have the password, agree to the terms and everything. And then you're just going to go ahead and submit it. And once you do that here, it's going to say your wallet is ready. Join 1.3 million users and claim your free username. Okay, so obviously you can claim your free username right now. Uh, but what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go on. I'll do it later. Okay, I don't really want to get into those technicalities right now. So once you do that here, you can see you are into your Coinbase wallet. Okay, now in your Coinbase wallet, obviously you can see a lot of things, you know, buy, swap, rate, send, receive, etc. You know, tons and tons of settings. Now, you can obviously mess around with a little bit of settings in it. You can add and manage different wallets. You can create a wallet or, you know, more stuff like that. Now, to send money from your Coinbase wallet into, you know, any um, bank account or maybe, you know, depositing it to some place. For that, what you're going to do, you're going to go into assets and you're going to click on send. Okay. And then obviously it says buyer transfer from Coinbase right now. As you can see, I don't have any currency in my wallet. But once you do have currency, what you're going to do is it's going to give an option to transfer. So you're going to go on transfer. You're going to make sure to choose, you know, where you're transferring it to. So you get three options. It could either be into another wallet or it could be, you know, to some credit card. Uh, I'm sorry, to some bank. Or it could be to just some decentralized credit card. Okay. And uh, you could, you know, deposit it to other wallets, as I said. But again, this is how you're going to deposit it to some bank account. So just click on send. And once you have crypto, this is the option that you're going to want to go with. So yeah. And then you can also swap your currency. Like let's say you have currency in Ethereum and you want to, you know, maybe swap it in USDT or something like that you know yeah swap it in a stable coin in a tether coin or something like that you know it totally depends on um, whatever your working you know way is however you want to actually you know spend your money around so pretty easy and pretty basic stuff to you know actually have for yourself to actually have in your repertoire so yeah basically i like to say that is about it for this video now if i were to give a brief overview of how you're going to do all of this go to coinbase.com slash wallet okay once you're over there you're going to make sure to uh, move over to the account creation process okay go ahead and make your account then you're going to make sure to go ahead and add the wallet okay now if you're on your phone you could add it to your phone if you're on your browser you could add it to your browser pretty simple stuff and then once you do that, obviously transfer currency into your wallet. And once you do that, you're going to send it directly from there to, you know, any bank account that you want. But obviously make sure that you have currency in your wallet. But yeah, uh, that's about it for this video. Now, if you enjoyed watching it, please do make sure to drop down a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, let me know down in the comments below and I will make more for you. But yeah, that's about it from me. Uh, thank you for watching till the end. And I will see all of you next time. Goodbye.